watching. Um, today's video is just going to be about um, wedding planning and how you can save some money when you are planning your wedding. I know that it can be really expensive, um, but if you plan it out and do a lot of research, there is a lot of ways you can save money. So let's go ahead and get on into the video. Alright, so for the first way that really helped us to save a lot of money was doing a lot of DIY centerpieces. Um, we just had some pretty simple centerpieces with flowers and mason jars. Mason jars are like my best friend throughout this whole wedding. Um, definitely if you give yourself some time to space it out, um, you can not be so stressed about money and kind of just show you how much everything is going to be. So DIY centerpieces are definitely a way to go if you're crafty, even if you're not crafty, look on Pinterest, there's some really, really easy ideas out there. Like mine, I just threw some lights in a mason jar and it was so cute. Like, there's also instructions on a lot of the Pinterest um, sites and it will explain step-by-step -step ways to do it. So it's very, very, very helpful. And the next way that I saved money was having a little book of planners. This was actually my little um, it was my wedding planner and <laughs> it helped me so much. Um, it's really important to do your research when you're looking at venues because a lot of places will try to be like, oh, we have the best price, no price lower than us, but in reality, they're just trying to get you to book with them, which of course is their job, but it's very important to do some research because I went to a lot of places that said, oh, we have the best bang for your buck, and it wasn't. <laughs> so. Yeah, um, I did a lot of the research looking at um, venues and finding the perfect one for me. And also just having along with a wedding like book is also a planner because a planner can really help you organize like what day you need to be doing wedding stuff and what day you can do other stuff. So it's really awesome just to have a, a planner. <laughs> can help you save money on your wedding day is to um, ask the venue if you can bring in some of your own drinks and hors d'oeuvres during the cocktail hour because a lot of places will, um, they want you to use their hors d'oeuvres but they're also like expensive ones so top of the notch ones like if you don't want, if you don't really care about hors d'oeuvres, my wedding coordinator basically told me you don't need to feed your guests before you feed them because you usually have cocktail hour bef like right before dinner. So cheese and crackers, grapes, fruit, anything like that is perfect idea. Um, and if you're able to bring it in, you can just make a Sam's Club trip and go and get a whole bunch of food and probably only spend like, I spent only 200 bucks when the hors d'oeuvres that they offered at the venue were I think 500 they wanted for them so there's no need to go with the venues if they let you bring them in so really look into that option when you're booking with a venue. And the last tip I have for you guys for um, saving money for your wedding day is to really just plan out everything. It will make a world of a difference because if you just go, I know Michael's was my number one to go store for my wedding, but before I went in there, I needed to write out a list. Like I have so many lists throughout here, like saying what exactly I need to buy because you'll walk into Michael's and you'll get overwhelmed and be like, oh, I need this and this and this. And you'll grab like things that you don't need. And of course you can always return them, but why bother with the hassle of that if you don't need to? So yeah, just make sure you plan out everything, write lists. Lists will be your best friend throughout this. So yeah. Alright you guys, and that's all I have for today's video. Um, please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed and subscribe to my channel for more videos. I hope this can help some of you guys save some money for your wedding. And if you would like some more tips and tricks, just let me know. Write in the comments below what you want to see. And yeah, so thank you all so much for watching. Have a great day. Mm -hmm.